Hi guys, it's Steve from Document Marked and Robot. In this video, I will go through how to use the main functions in Document Marked and Robot. Let's start off with the system settings. These settings are the global settings that's used throughout the PDF generator module. These settings themselves, we can set a number of threads to run when generating PDFs, two is adequate. We can set which third party spinner we wish to use, the best spinner, spinner chief or spin chimp. We also set our Twitter account that we wish to use. Ensure that you test both your Twitter account and also your whichever spinner API account you're using to make sure that these work before they are used. The other options are the spinner options which here max number of sins here we can put in the number of spins we get through the API. I'll change it to 5 protect keywords when spinning. We wish to do this as we do not want our keywords to be span as we want to link to these keywords. Spin quality. This is the quality of article you will end up with when it has been span. I'll choose best quality is the best quality. You get less spin but it's extremely readable. Let's save the data and I'll exit. First we'll go to the Create PDF Articles module. Within this module, as you can see, we've got a number of campaigns, number of articles we've added or scraped, and we've got a number of keywords which we can add to our article. So we would, for example, check this article on hypnosis. As we can see, we've got hypnosis, hypnosis in different parts of the article. If we choose hypnosis to anchor, we choose the article itself. And if we insert, for example, four links, that will link to the word hypnosis within this article and we simply generated as you can see this has been generated and this is the name of the file itself I will open the file and we can have a look at the links that have been created as you can see this is the file And we have hypnosis, hypnosis, hypno hypnosis, and hypnosis. So we've got the four of these have been linked, as you can see. And within the document, no other word hypnosis has been linked. So that's a simple overview of the linking process itself. We can also insert footer links which will insert a number of links but only one link per keyword. So for example if we had 20 keywords in here we were linking we only wanted six to be in the footer we choose six and only six different links get inserted. We can also insert spin tax when we generate the article itself what this means is that for example in our hypnosis article at the where shown here this contains no spin tax so we can insert spin tax before it's generated 
it will insert the spin tax and generate a new unique version of the PDF article itself. So let's start by creating a new project. We call this one Nintendo Wii. As you can see, everything's been cleared down. We can import a text article. The first line of the article will be used as the title. We can import multiple articles from a folder, but I'll show scraping an article. So first we'll add a keyword in, Nintendo, Nintendo Wii. We'll select from a number of sites. We'll scrape two articles and we'll find which articles are, are available on the sites themselves. Progress 100%. We'll just select them all download selected articles because when we find articles we only get the title and the summary it doesn't actually download the article itself so we'll download selected articles as we can see it's downloading the articles off the sites that's them downloaded in this window we can double click on the article and it will show us the content so we can choose if we want to use this article or not. So I'll choose I'll choose these four articles. I've selected four. So these four will be imported. Save selected articles. As you can see, I've got four articles have been imported. If I double click on these articles, I can get the article text. And I can take any additional spaces if needed. Most should be okay. Let's save that. Next, we'll add some anchor text keywords. Nintendo, Nintendo Wii, HTTP. Nintendo.com as an example URL. Add to list. We can also spin the URLs using standard spin tax, and this is shown here the bottom right hand corner of the screen. So, so I added Nintendo, added in Nunchuk. Let's check this. Definitely. In here, I'll add a Wii system instead. And this time, I will spin the URL. So, open brace, we separate our URLs by a pipe. Nintendo.com. Nintendo.co.uk. As you can see, I've separated these by a pipe. And we've got an open brace and a close embrace. That is the syntax for spinning your URL. Note you cannot spin the, the anchor text keyword itself, only the URL. So I will choose these two keywords. I will choose these two articles. I will insert six links and two footer links. I'll set a target folder. And now I will generate two articles based on these two. There we go, we've got two created. And let's check out these two articles. Here is a generated PDF. And as we can see, we've linked Nintendo Wii and Wii System throughout the 
document but only six times per keyword if we have less than six keywords in the document only the number of keywords in the document will be linked as we can see you've got the footer links on the end as well we can also insert syntax into the articles themselves so for example on this article here I'll select this article right click the mouse select add spin tax to selected articles yes then the spin tax will be added the spin tax has now been added we can check if we have already added spin tax by checking the content spun if you manually add spin tax this will show us no but when the system adds spin tax it will show us yes you can see the titles being spun if we double click we can see within the text itself we have a number of spun spun areas what we can do we can check the spin preview spin so we need to actually click on the article itself preview spin as we can see it's been spun we need a number of previews read through the article check that the article makes sense if not you may need to change some of the spin tax within the article itself the last option we have is to auto insert spin tax and then spin the article itself so we'll choose this article this time choose auto insert spin tax and generate and as you can see the article has been spun spin tax inserted and the keywords themselves have been linked if we wish to use only particular keywords for particular articles we would simply unselect the keyword and select the articles we wish to use if we wish to manually add an article we simply click add manual article we can type this in or paste this in this is a demo note the minimum characters needs to be 300 within the body itself so demo test let's just generate enough text now we we'll see that and as we can see this is a demo has been added in here can if we want add spin tax as we did before and this will be shown as a yes and that is basically all the functions that we use to generate PDF articles it's really really simple we can also switch projects from the drop-down list if we so wish the other two items are promotional items we can use the PDF links module to check which links we have created for the campaigns within the poster software as you can see we can validate export add URLs to this list if we wish on the promote articles themselves we will get a list of the campaigns from the poster application so this will not show the campaigns from the PDF creator this is from the PDF poster and we simply select 
when your links switch to post we can ping those links we can also send these links to Twitter any selected links will get posted we set a delay if you're posting a lot of links increase this delay we simply add in our tweet text awesome link we can add in spin tax find out more click this link now and the link is added at the end of the tweet so we can check the length we simply click tweet selected links and the software goes away uses the settings for the account that you set in the settings area and the tweets are sent out at whatever delay that you set if you've got a lot of links you must increase the delay otherwise you risk your Twitter account being banned.